Good morning. Nice and blue and beautiful today. Thought I'd come out and sit and share something with you. I was thinking about ruling and reigning with Christ and those who rule and reign with Christ during Eonian times to the consummation. Ruling and reigning will end um, and it'll come to a close when Christ abdicates everything, the whole universe, a reconciled universe back to his God and Father and God becomes all in all. But this is a long process of time. I believe that last eon is just a very extremely long period of time. Um, and during that time, Christ will exercise his king, kingly position. Um, he will be what the scriptures say he is, king of kings and lord of lords. So I'm going to share some scripture on the word reign. Um, the Greek is basilio. English elements simply means simply our be king so it's a kingly station that christ has during eonian times along with the body of christ we will rule and reign with him those who endure the concordant definition exercise a king's sovereignty um the concordant scripture first timothy six fifteen, you can see right here which to its own heirs the happy and only potentate will be showing. He is king of kings and lord of lords. And this is Christ our Lord. Um, Romans 5.14 Nevertheless, de death reigns from Adam unto Moses over, over those also who do not sin in the likeness of the transgression of Adam, who is a type of him who is about to be. Romans 5.17 For if by the offense of the one, death reigns through the one, much rather those obtaining the superabundance of grace and the gratuity of righteousness shall be reigning in life through the one, Jesus Christ. <clears throat> Romans 5.21, that, that even as sin reigns in death, thus grace also should be reigning through righteousness for life Eonian, through Jesus Christ our Lord. Romans 6.12, let not, let not sin then be reigning in your mortal body, for you to be obeying its lusts. 1 Corinthians 4, 8. Already you are sad it. Are you sad it? Already are you rich. Apart from us you reign. And would that you surely reign, that we also should be reigning together with you. 2 Timothy 2.12. 2, uh, if we are enduring, right here, if we are enduring, we shall be reigning together also. If we are disowning, he will, he will also be disowning us. But he cannot disown himself. So those who are a part of Christ are solid in Christ, no matter what. And the last one is beautiful. 1 Corinthians 15, 25 and 26. For he must be reigning until, right there, until he should be placing all his enemies under his feet. This is at the consummation. The last enemy is being abolished, death. 